Tanzania is at the very crossroads of the great African trading routes, which for millennia have recorded layer upon layer of humanity's endeavors to build cultural links, networks of commerce, and even empires. From the Dow building centers on Lake Tanganyika, where Stanley and Livingston had their famous meeting, across the caravan trails and on to the splendor of its coastal cities and offshore islands, Tanzania's rich past goes back centuries. Zanzibar, the legendary spice island bathed in an equatorial sun, a repository of a thousand years of African, Indian and Arab influence. Stone Town, the ancient capital with its magnificent architecture set on the shores of a vibrant sea. No wonder the Omani Sultan Said and his descendants decided to make it their home, and in doing so, also make Zanzibar the most important and best known trading center in the Western Indian Ocean. In this airy but labyrinthine city, the past and the present form a heady mix that can be seen in the architecture, the culture, the people, and of course, the music. But beyond the bustling, colorful streets of Stone Town, calm returns. And just a stone's throw from the metropolis, the island's natural paradise once again regains the upper hand. Well, almost. And after the parties and festivals, after the day's work is done, dusk approaches first these palm-fringed islands, then the busy coastal towns, and finally the infinite inland wilderness that is Tanzania's hinterland. And, as inevitable as the setting sun, tomorrow will come. Tutaonana badai, as we say in Swahili. See you soon. <laughs>